It's day 61 in the apocalypse and Gigamosh Chadamos is bored. And frankly, so am I. We've built an absolute fortress of a base. However, we don't really face any challenges and we could just become a hermit and ride the rest of the 40 days out inside of our base. However, that's really boring. So I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna go on a mission to move to Louisville, which is one of the most daunting places in Project Zomboid. It's gonna have to happen in two phases. Phase one is we're gonna move to West Point, which is like the halfway mark, build a temporary base. And then phase two would be moved to Louisville and build a base completely from scratch. Hopefully settled by day 100. So let's get into it. Like it's all well and good having like a well established base with a generator and a farm and a water source. But it's kind of like I could hermit now. I could just sit inside my base for the next 40 days and say oh I've done 100 days. But that's just boring. I think that's everything I need. I don't want to take too much because I'm not moving there permanently. I just want to have a bit of a vacation. Uh oh. No, 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 no. No way. No, 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 no way. I've been bitten. Climb the fence, bro. So we're going on an adventure. We're going to go to March Ridge. We're going to set up a temporary base, probably at the gas station. Um, and then we are going to set sail to Louisville. Which is quite daunting because I've never actually been there and I'm not a pro Project Zomboid player. I've just lost a wheel. How is this still driving? Is this just going to like permanently damage the car? What is happening? This driving on the axle is just gonna destroy my car. That's a tree. Oh god. Whoops a daisies. Is the engine completely broken? Condition 0%. Oh god. I know, yeah, my truck's here. My old truck. But I didn't realise, I didn't know how fucked it was. Not too bad. It looks beaten up, but it's actually alright. It's got a fuel tank of fuel as well. Nice little one by one house here. Then we'll turn in for the night, it's half eight. Let's see how far we are from Martridge now. We're not too far. We're not too far at all, really. because I know we're going to get stressed because there's a fair amount of zombies around here and let's just start the carnage let's try and lead him away I don't want a bunch of dead zombies on my front garden oh god I don't really want them that way oh god this isn't going to go well I 
have to uh, use this tree line. She needs to get some lucky hits. be able to run up and lose them to the houses. I think that's what's going to have to happen. Uh, this is dangerous. Jesus, man, there are so many. Oh, God, they're just everywhere, man. Leave me alone. You know what, I've made two gas station bases. Let's make a base here instead. To be fair, let's have a look at the map. I don't think I'm too far. No, I'm a couple of hundred meters. Some sort of factory. Across the road is the gas station. I'm trying to be as stealthy as possible because I, I can't keep just taking every battle head on. Right. It's American, so the driver's side's on the left. I need to hop in, start that gas, and get the frick out of here. Whee! Nerds. Right. So we would have lost the majority of them then. Cut through this car park, can't I? Like, why are you heading towards my base? Like, there's no noise. I'm the only one here. This is a myth. This game has got out for me. Like, like why, are you, why are you all coming here? This has got to be some sort of joke. Like, what is this all about? Oh, that was stupid. the main thing, we need like, like the water jug, move all the guns up, right 6am, I think we're just going to have to grab a shotgun and just go ham, we've got 150 shells, we're definitely going to bring in a fair few but let's get it. Let's get back to that car park. Let's lead them, lead them somewhat away. <laughs> oh god! This is a good idea in my head. Wow, 
that was a golden shot. Then spent the next few days looting the gun shop, turning to the factory area to grab a generator, making the temporary base more comfortable. I think this took me about six or so days. If you enjoyed this video, please let me know down below, like, sub, and flick on the notification bell just so you're told every time I post. Most importantly, take it easy out there. Peace.